Finally, the real father of Cora Obidi's children are revealed are exposed by her husband, Justin Dean. So the true father, the real father, the biological father of Cora Obidi's children are now revealed. Hey, no more talk. And it's done by her husband. This is, you know, revealed by her own husband. The man that came out, you know, to accuse that, you know, spill all the things, all the things that have been going on in the marriage. Hey. So this story today just will be a eh? hey hey gang gang. So hello guys and welcome back again to my YouTube channel. It's me your girl, ge 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 Kelly baby. If you're new to my channel, you are highly highly welcome. Please remember to subscribe. Just find that red button down there that says subscribe. After that, turn on your notification bell. That will be notified anytime I drop any new video. So if you're a subscriber, you are highly, highly welcome. My people, my people, your man, Jam, Bandin, Jago, my backbones, my sweetheart and darlings, you guys are the best. Um, I can't thank you guys enough for your support, for your love. Thank you guys. I pray that the good Lord will bless you and enlarge your scope. Whatever you lay your hand this year, that is good. The beautiful Lord is going to make it a success in Jesus' name. Amen. So guys, grab your popcorn, your champagne, and sit your hands down. Let's, you know, dissect, dissect, do everything, set them <laughs> let us have fun on this video okay yes so guys um like i said earlier that the true father hey the real father of kora obidi's children has been exposed has been revealed by her own husband hey now me hey this one now eh so guys, who is the real father of this beautiful, adorable kids? In fact, eh, I feel so, you know, somehow because minors are involved here. I don't like talking about minors on my channel. I don't want to talk about kids here. Like um, my channel, I, I try to make it as fun as it possible it can be why talking about people you know even though our channel is not about bashing channel we don't bash people we don't call people's name we talk things and set things straight um but because these kids are involved um i'm feeling somehow you know because they are still innocent they don't deserve this thing they are getting you get so um the husband i saw this on linda ekg's um blog the husband recently came out, I think yesterday. I wanted to make this video yesterday, but you know, church thing. I charged you guys look at you. Now, church thing, church just took my time, okay? Hey, we did not dismiss a uh, service um, earlier enough for me to make the video. So, I had two videos going up yesterday. I ended up posting one. So, guys, I saw this thing. Um, the chorus husband came out, you know, to clear the air, to, you know, spill the tea, you know. Um, to focus here and focus here yeah, for China, but off of that, yeah, for that, yes. Hey, if you're not sure at this time, sorry. Hey, this my beautiful Igbo sisters and brother, they will understand what I'm saying. So, what it means that Okwala called Bon Subo, he broke the coconut, okay? So, according to the man, um, the beautiful kids, how um, his wife, Kora Obidi, um, had for him that those kids are uh, <laughs> drum roll drum, those kids are his own kids yes one those kids are his are his are his do you read my list they are his for those of people that you know it's written that um dna test has proven it that um those kids uh, are not his he was not the one that you know impregnated his beautiful wife okay um i don't know where people used to get the news there are some of the news that can you know make copy it to get a, a a lot of subscribers and a, a lot of views but i don't want to go into what i am not sure of you can see that whenever i'm making um, videos or uh, you know reporting about this i'm not sure of i'll tell you i'm not sure of that this is my in um instinct or what i think that is happening um people will just come out and you know talk about things they don't know just because um they want views 
um, I watched one video um, on Saturday, was it on Saturday or Friday, talking about the DNA test, even trying to prove, bring out the proof that the DNA test proved that the, those kids are not his. That, like, those kids will grow up tomorrow to see all these dramas, okay? Um, personally, let us not be the reason why we are tearing things apart. Um, from frying pan to fire, some of vloggers, what we do is here is that we, we, we add, um, you know, fuel, petrol, or, you know, anything that we, you know, increase the fire, we add it to the already burning fire, my dear. Um, personally, I don't like to carry news I'm not sure of. So, um, Dimas reviewed it that he is the biological father of those kids. Okay, and there's another shocking revelation the man, you know, revealed that his wife is not a chronicle. Chira, chita, chira. Anyone you want to pick, pick. So the wife is not a chronicle chira, as he know. He insinuated in his first right of, um, you know, he just, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. He just said that the wife, you know, cheated at the beginning of the relationship. Because we don't know whether when they are married or when they, was, they were still dating as boyfriend and girlfriend. You know, um, when they were still dating, which most of us did that. You can have one or two boyfriends and you have the male one. I didn't do it too, personally. But you cannot judge somebody in the beginning of relationship because the person might not know where the relationship is heading to. So for that, I cannot even count that as a cheating. Uh, unless she did it in the beginning of the marriage. But what the man said is relationship. So we don't know whether marriage relationship or you no know, boyfriend and girlfriend relationship. So another thing I want to talk about here is that... So um, the one thing I want to ship in here is just an advice to everybody. Advice to both married and unmarried because um, as a young girl, as a spinster or a young guy, um, you know, you know you will still get married in the future or you're already in a relationship or married. Marriage, do you get? Um, see, personally, I'm a lover of marriage. I'm a lover of good things. I'm a lover of anything that is good. Um, I would personally advise that when things are not going too well in your relationship keep it to yourself yes make decision by yourself you know um i don't understand i don't get it this social media age is really you know destroying a lot of things okay see those kids will still grow up tomorrow to see what their um, their father wrote about their mom krishna he's coming out to deny or you know to clear um, the air, not deny, he's coming out, you know, to kind of clear the air that what he said, maybe out of emotions, out of, you know, anger, which is not supposed to be done. Okay? Those kids will still grow up tomorrow to see those things you wrote about their mom. And how do you think that those kids will see you or take you as a responsible father? Now, I can remember when the one with this Nigerian celebrities, um, Annie Dibia and the, her husband, Two Baba, two face in Dibia. When that one broke out, you guys know now, but last year, right? Last year or last two years, Abby? Um, last year. So, it's 2021. So, um, you know the dramas, all the things Annie talked about her husband, all the ill things she talked. Later on, weeks after, she came out to apologize. She came out to, you know, debunk, apologize, you know. Up to today, let me tell you personally, whenever I, I see her writing good things about her husband now, praising her husband, I don't take it as anything. Like, to me, you, you have come out to tell us the real thing. Like, this one is cover up. This one is like medicine after death, as in damage control. That's what I call them. Okay? Um, our advice personally, if things are not going well in your marriage, uh, your relationship, you feel like you will give it a break give it a, you know a distance do anything you want to do to get your sanity back your mental health is very you know important i know social media cannot give you all those things you are looking for give it a break take a break um separate from the person for a while maybe after some you know time or give it a time you can you know regain yourself and you know so you come back together and still uh, continue the marriage 
Nobody knows. But coming out to cry on social media, let me tell you, the only thing you get on social media is sympathy. And probably you entertain people because believe it or leave it, a lot of people are entertained. That's like, I don't think they are up to 30% genuine sympathizers. Yes! They are not up to 30% genuine sympathizers. Because the truth is that um, a lot of people are on social media to be entertained. So um, we convert everything, both life issues and everything, to entertainment. So you have ended up entertaining a lot of people. And people, the, even the sympathizers you get, it will still not hear your marriage. It will still not, you know, do things in your marriage and make up the reason why you posted it. Most of you think that when you come out on social media to cry, they cry, that, um, you know, it, it will justify anything or it will make your marriage... I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. This generation, I mean, the generation, my generation, I don't know. Ah, social media cannot, you know, build your home for you. Social media cannot make your wife to love you, cannot make your husband to, you know, change. You are just attracting, you know, unhealthy sympathy to your marriage. Because believe it or leave it, anywhere I see two baba or um, that is two face tomorrow, I'm looking at him like, the first thing the wife wrote about him because that's the main truth to me i believe about and that's how people see that so uh, a lot of people believe that cora this is like a damage control that cora really you know so my people i've said all i want to say all i come here to say our people will say <laughs> our people will say meaning i've said all i have to say i've broken that uh, coconut okay <laughs> it's an ad day so um leave whatever your opinion might be down there um on the comment section okay let me hear from you guys. What do you guys think? And remember to like this video. Like it, please. Have you like this video? Like it and there. Um, share the video. Do all that good stuff that will, you know, make this channel visible for others to see. And with this, I'll see my next video. Bye-bye.